the coast expecting high surf to arrive with the next big storm. Berms are being shored up and equipment being put in place for the next mess expected to arrive this weekend. Yeah, but some are taking advantage of the weather to hang 10. KCAL News Orange County reporter Michelle Geely is live this afternoon in Huntington Beach with mm. more on that. Michelle. And I've got two words to describe today. Massive waves for people here who know their surf. They say they haven't seen conditions like this in at least 15 years. It was another epic surf day in Orange County. Yeah, it's horrible. Which is surf speak for amazing. Waves in Seal Beach on the south side of the pier were 10, 12, and 15 feet high at times. Is it 15 to 20 or more like 10 to 12? 10 to 12 could be, but when you're on it, it's like 20 foot. <laughs> <laughs> in Huntington Beach, big surf was also the story enough for a surf advisory to be issued. It definitely puts us a bit on alert because with a higher surf, there's a bit more consequence for people that might become in distress in the water. So with that, we just take a more proactive posture. There were plenty of people who opted to watch from the safety of the pier and tourists who posed with the waves in the distance to share with friends back home. Locals in Seal Beach marveled at a spot called Cloud Break near the jetty that rarely sees this kind of wave action. I saw a guy from the end of the jetty surf all the way in. You saw that too, and he got some photos of it, some guys. In the intense surf, we caught a man wake skating, which is a cross between wakeboarding and skateboarding. Lifeguards like Bobby Kithcart, who did brave the expert conditions, says if you're in doubt, don't go out. The distance between waves is a ton of power. It's like sucking out to sea. So very dangerous, but a good workout. Now things were so amazing in Seal Beach. The waves were even breaking off of oil platform Esther, which is a mile and a half offshore. Again, this surf advisory continues through the weekend. That's the latest live at the Huntington Beach Pier. I'm Michelle Geely. Back to you. Michelle, thank you so much. It happens every time a storm rolls through. The dreaded potholes pop up all over Southland streets. And drivers, of course, need to be extra careful for them.